Today is planting time, so we will be planting walnut trees today. We will also be spreading the agar compost where the trees will sit in. So uh, let's get going. So this year it's also time to fill up the rest of this field, as we still have 10 empty rows here between the welland and the unigaret. And we will be planting welland there as well. And one row will stay free besides the unigaret because we want to give the trees a little bit of space. So the new trees won't get infect infected by the old trees with diseases and everything what they carry. So uh, let's start drilling holes here as well so we can start planting. So it's time to take off the forklift and the drill from the tractor, as that's done now. And we will attach this bucket to the tractor again to distribute the soil. And I have put a new auger in since last year. So this one is completely new and I hope no stones will come in the soil. Then it won't get damaged. I also took the extra stuff that was in front of here off last year. Now it will mount closer to the tractor so we can load it even more full before the tractor starts to lift at the front end.
So that spreading of the compost went really well. Actually it went too well. We lost way too much compost while driving. And I ended up driving in the third gear, idling while having the PTO at the lowest gear. And it was still throwing it out way too fast. Instead I'm gonna make some kind of hedge so the spreader will spread less compost while it's rotating. We have to see if it works. So the idea is to make a slide here that will slide in front of the pole and hopefully that will make it spread a little bit less. So let's see if we can fabricate something for that. So I made the plate, I made the back mounting and I also mounted guidance on the plate. So the plate is guided between this plate. I did it separate because I cannot cut this one straight enough and I also did not know exactly how to weld this one onto. So I first made this contraption and then welded the guidance on so it's guided perfectly between there. Now let's continue welding. So let's get spreading again, spreader works.
So the spreader is working like it's arm. It's uh, spread it perfectly. It's not too thick here, but uh, it's just an amount we need. And we will shovel that also in the hole when we plant the tree. That way the roots of the tree are completely filled with uh, soil. So that's really neat. So the next thing we have to do is clean up the ground. So if it rains this winter, all the water will go towards the trees and also for the upcoming summer. We want to have a clean sand lane at the trees. All the manure and water and everything that we give the tree will go towards the tree and not towards the grass. 